A video recently went viral comparing two approaches to autonomous vehicle technology, Tesla's camera-only system and LiDAR systems. Posted by YouTuber Mark Rober, the video was designed to be a fun and engaging experiment, testing how well Tesla's autopilot, not full self-driving, system and Luminar's LiDAR system could handle six different scenarios involving a child running into the road. The scenarios included a child standing in front of the vehicle, running into the road unexpectedly, being in fog or rain, dealing with bright lights, and navigating around a wild e coyote-style wall with a painted road on it. While the comparison may seem straightforward, there's been a significant amount of backlash and confusion about the video. The most dramatic moments in the video centered around the wild e coyote wall, which is obviously a non-realistic test meant for entertainment value. This is where many critics have missed the point, as the real value of the video was in the other tests that focused on more practical driving conditions like fog, rain, and bright lights. The results of the comparison revealed that LiDAR performed better in certain circumstances, especially in fog and rain, where its laser-based technology is better suited to see through these conditions. LiDAR's ability to actively send out laser pulses, unlike the passive vision of cameras, allows it to create a clearer picture of the environment. However, the conditions in the test were extreme, with nearly biblical levels of rain and fog, which are far more intense than what drivers typically encounter in daily driving. In milder conditions, the camera systems may perform similarly or even better. Hello EV fans, welcome back to EV's gallery. Hope you guys are doing well. From the latest industry updates to in-depth reviews of the hottest EV models, we are here to keep you charged with electrifying news and insights. We are thrilled to announce the launch of three exclusive membership levels on our channel, Spark, Voltage, and Gigawatt. Are you ready to supercharge your support and join an exclusive community of like-minded electric vehicle fans? Become a member of our channel today. By joining, you'll not only fuel our journey together but also unlock fantastic perks tailored just for you. So, if you haven't subscribed yet, now's the perfect time to join the EV revolution. Hit that subscribe button, and don't forget to turn on the notification bell to stay charged with the latest updates. Tesla's camera-only approach, which eliminates LiDAR and radar, has often been a point of contention. Critics argue that it leaves Tesla at a disadvantage compared to other automakers who use a hybrid system combining cameras, LiDAR, radar, and ultrasonics. Tesla, however, has defended this approach, with Elon Musk believing that cameras alone can achieve full autonomy, as humans drive with only two eyes and no lasers. One of the primary benefits of Tesla's vision-only approach is cost and complexity. Cameras are cheaper than LiDAR sensors, and a vision-only system is simpler, potentially leading to more straightforward software development. Tesla also has the advantage of massive amounts of real-world driving data, with millions of Teslas collecting vision data on the road. This data allows Tesla to refine its systems in a way that few competitors can match. On the flip side, LiDAR's advantage lies in its ability to provide a more robust understanding of the surroundings, especially in poor weather conditions or when other sensors might be obstructed. While cameras can be hampered by heavy rain or fog, LiDAR can penetrate these conditions better, offering more reliable data in these scenarios. Still, for more common weather conditions, cameras may be sufficient, though this depends on their being properly maintained and not obstructed. The video also sparked some confusion due to its use of the term self-driving. Tesla's autopilot is not truly self-driving, it's a level 2 system, meaning the driver must still be in control. Full self-driving, FSD, is a more advanced version but still requires driver oversight. In contrast, some systems like Mercedes Drive Pilot, which uses LiDAR, are considered closer to level 3 autonomy, where the vehicle can drive itself under certain conditions. In the context of the video, Tesla's autopilot was used, but the title of the video, Can You Fool a Self-Driving Car, led to some misconceptions. While the test showed that LiDAR systems had some benefits in certain scenarios, particularly in challenging weather, Tesla's cameras still held up well in most of the tests, demonstrating that their approach has merit, even if it isn't perfect. The real takeaway from the video is that both systems have strengths and weaknesses, with LiDAR providing advantages in certain conditions and Tesla's vision-only approach offering a simpler, less expensive solution. The ongoing debate between these two approaches will continue, but it's important to remember that this video, while entertaining, should not be the final word in the argument over autonomous driving technology. 
The most controversial aspect of the video was the Wild E. Coyote test, which, while fun, isn't a realistic scenario for real-world driving. The dramatic reactions surrounding this test overshadowed the more meaningful findings from the other tests. In the end, while LiDAR has its advantages, the debate over whether it's essential for full autonomy continues. Tesla's focus on vision-only technology, bolstered by its massive real-world data, makes it a formidable player in the autonomous driving race, but only time will tell if this approach will be enough to overcome the limitations of camera-based systems. Thank you so much for joining us today. We love hearing your thoughts and insights, so don't forget to share your comments and feedback in the comments section below. Your engagement means a lot to us, and it keeps the conversation going. If you enjoyed today's content and want to stay updated with the latest news, be sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications. That way, you won't miss out on any future updates.